earlier this month, my idler pulley, the original, um, the bearings went in it, so I had to get a replacement. When I put the replacement in, however, it was a bit too small, causing my belt to slip, I believe. So I have the actual real size part that I'm going to go put in my truck now. Always doing something. Alright, so since I think I know what I'm doing, um, I'm going to do the job on the truck, but I'm smart enough to uh, do it at a 24-hour AutoZone parking lot. That way, if I break something, I can go in there and get the part. This should only take 15 minutes. So there's the original one that broke, right? This is an idler, idler pulley, and this is the one I got temporarily for it. See? You see the size difference right there? I don't think it's holding enough tension. So, I have a brand new one that's just the same size as the old one I'm going to install. Alright, all done. I had to disconnect my air filter to get to the tension arm. Um, right here, where that black wheel is, that's a good view of it. That's what I just replaced. So, since I got my air filter apart, I'm going to bang it out and clean it. And then we'll fire her over. We'll turn her over. She should run smooth. That didn't take me too long. Running good. I got the uh, the box and the receipt from the um, the pulley that was too small. So I'm gonna see if I can return it because it's still in great working condition. Why not? It's twenty five dollars. This always reminds me of being down the shore in Wildwood. You know, with all the neon lights and everything. It's pretty cool. I still say it every time. I hate to pay their electric bill, that's for sure. Second time this week. I think Mr. Martin has learned a new trick. I think he can climb down from the roof now. So that means you're running around out in the city without me, huh, buddy? He's got to learn how to walk. <laughs> I'll drink beer with you if you want me to. It won't get old. Yeah, we'll drink it ice cold. I'll drink beer with you if you ask me to. Yeah, we'll drink it right, baby, all through the night. Going old country western tonight. My truck, my pony, my truck, my pride. My truck, me amigo, my truck, I will ride. Through the streets of Philly, beneath the night sky, we'll ride on forever, just my truck and I. Yeah. You want to tell me why Great Grandma is walking around on Kensington Avenue at 1.30 in the morning? Whose turn was it to watch her? Why is she out there? Ain't got no business being out there. That shit ain't right. Really. Alright, we're back. So, I found this little food scale thing, right? I guess it's from Weight Watchers, so what I'm going to do is leave it right here at Wawa's window for somebody to find. You know why? Because that's the dumb shit that I do. Remember, I'm your unlimited plan with no contract. Satisfaction? Maybe. And you don't have to be afraid of the dark. Just what lurks in it. I ain't always right, but I'm never wrong. <laughs> it's insane that we live in a country that's so rich that can just throw things like this away. You know, this is a, this is sad. This is an overabundance of milk, so I'm going to take all this down to the shelter. Because I can't see this going bad. There's a little community of people that live in this tent right here. Stop off and give them some milk. <clears throat> uh, yep. Are you tired? Everybody came and started grabbing everything. <laughs> That's good though. Now plenty of milk over here if you're thirsty. No problem. All right, another job well done.
That's a Philadelphia street lunatic. Oh, man. It's just an old crate on the side of the road. It was left there by somebody who, who really didn't really care. And now it sits and waits for you. Yeah, the voices are strong in my, in my head tonight. Very strong. We're back. You know, I don't drink. I don't smoke. And I never swear. Oh, shit! I left my cigarettes at the bar! Well, that great big fireball thing showed up again. It's up there in the sky. Uh-uh. Everybody knows I'm too damn ugly to be walking around in the daylight. I'll be scaring the children. <laughs> yeah. Children. Yeah, you. You probably did it. You right there. You know, there's nothing better than stepping in a nice, ice-cold puddle of cat puke because it's the same color as your hardwood floor. Yummy!